morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Karen Emerson, and today I have with me my technician, Mary Parker, and this cute little 19-month-old Boston Terrier is Rafe. And Rafe came in a few months ago because he needed to get just a normal castration. Well, I'd been talking to Rafe's parents earlier, you know, in the months ahead, I mean, before that, about, you know, something called brachiocephalic syndrome. And all that means is that some animals that have the squished-in noses, you know, like the Boston Terriers, the French Bulldogs, and other types of Bulldogs, it, it basically what that means is their nose is kind of what we call stenotic, pushed in, and they also have something called an elongated soft palate. And all that means is the palate that, that goes over uh, your trachea when you swallow, his was just, could be and a little bit extra long. So I asked him, I said, well, while he's under anesthesia getting his castration, do you mind if I check that and check his nose? Because we have a surgical procedure we can perform where we actually, it's kind of like plastic surgery of the nose, where we go in and cut out a piece on each side of the nose to make the nostrils open up so he can breathe better. Before this procedure, you could hear him breathing from, gosh, in the other room. So this is this is during surgery before. As you can see, he has hardly any air uh, room for him to breathe. So what we did is I actually did a, an incision on each side and took out pieces of the nose. And here is the product. This is just suture you're seeing up here. But look how much by doing that simple procedure, we opened up his airways um, in his nose to help him. And it's a very inexpensive procedure that we can do while they're under anesthesia, having, having any other procedures done. Done, but it's actually a life-changing procedure for your pets. He did not have an elongated soft palate, so he didn't have to have any other types of surgery. But a lot of times with brachiocephalic dogs, they do have to have both procedures done at the same time. And it's a good time to do it when they're young, you know, when they're getting spayed or getting neutered. Um, so they let us do this procedure, and it was amazing what it did for Rafe. The way it opened his nose up, his quality of life's better. He's able to actually uh, bring air in and out without making that, you know, if you have a dog that's brachiocephalic, you constantly hear that gurgling sound or that snoring sound constantly. It helped with that. This is the most silent, don't you agree, Mary yeah. Parker, that we've ever, ever heard of Rose. So not only did we neuter him to prevent him from getting prostate and testicular cancer, we also uh, fixed his nares. So if you have a dog at home that you notice is suffering from this, maybe not breathing well, getting a lot of upper respiratory infections, that's not normal. Give us a call and make that appointment, and I promise your pets will thank you. WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.